Hey guys, welcome to another video. Today, I will be ranking your DTI. X, I will be playing in my Discord's farming server so make sure to join below in the description. These submissions were also from members of my server. This is inspired by another DTI YouTuber, I will link their video in the description. Anyways, let's begin. When someone puts on a hijab and a revealing outfit with it, it's not that hard to be respectful and it's so annoying coming from a former Muslim lamel and when outfits that didn't go by the theme at all get within the top three. These are pretty common X though. I agree with the first one so much. Even though I am not a Muslim, it is still sad to see the hijab get disrespected like that. I don't use it because I don't want to make an outfit potentially be inappropriate, but maybe if the theme is a bit more modest in the future, could try use it one day. I've seen the most gorgeous outfits with the hijab and the whole water muslim trend when it first came out was disgusting, so glad it died out. For the second ick, the rage inside me. When someone places when they didn't follow the theme is immeasurable. I do notice it is always a bit more of a complex theme however like gothic romance, sci-fi, cyberpunk for example. And yes, I do know not everyone has the privilege of having two devices and being able to look up a theme and inspo on Google, but would it really kill you to just ask someone else in the server who could potentially know? It's really not that hard and if no, one replies, just look at the other outfits that people are making in-game and try to make something that looks similar or at least with the same color palette. I had a girl get mad at me once because I called her out for doing her own theme because she refused to look up the theme and she was going off on me. It's even worse when they decide to do a custom theme of like, Disney Princess which is so overused by the way, instead of a pretty standard theme of Y2K. This is such a common ick but I don't know how I still see thousands of people doing this in every DTI server. Next ick. I really hate it when I absolutely devoured a theme and I get last place. First place is always some fur abuser. I wish they could implement a system that could get rid of unfair voting. I don't know what but something. I also hate how expensive VIP is. No game pass should ever be over 500 robux. The fur abusers oh my god. I got like 10 submissions solely on the fur abusers. Honest to god I don't think I used fur like that when I first started playing which was the old lobby. Like please tell me how an outfit like this manages to win over some of the most jaw-dropping gorgeous outfits I've seen, it genuinely baffles me. I don't think there's much GG can do about unfair voting unless you join a farming server or a fair voting server on Discord. As for VIP, I think the perm price is pretty decent but the monthly price is really up there. 200 plus robux for a trial at VIP basically? It definitely should only be about 100. Alright. Next ick. Ah, uh, nobody voted for me. Girl, get your crusty musty yubba tubba looking outfit out. There's a reason why nobody likes that icky mucky yusty gorilla looking outfit. Like, no. Well, that was a roller coaster of words. But it's always, no offense, the lowest rank models that always complain that no one voted them. But if you introduce the fact that, hey, you can actually wear multiple items at the same time and layer them, their minds will be blown. It's crazy that some of them say, ah, I didn't place ya yeah, for a reason, hun. Your outfit is so basic and you have VIP and you're a fashion maven. Most of the times voting is kind of fair, so unless your outfit is jaw-droppingly gorgeous and you came last don't comment. If you're unsure just ask someone but don't be the person to complain in the server. If it gets to that point where it's just teamers, leave the server. Alright, let's read to more. The hosts in free play. Like WHAD do you mean we didn't follow the theme ITS free play? I don't really play in free play but the couple of times I did try it, the hosts kept sending announcements about the theme. Like no. Unicorn Lover 56 I'm trying to plan an outfit for a video and I need honest opinions for it. I don't want to do your monster high theme for the 17th time. Like can we get GG to make an option where we can report a judge or something in game so a team of mods can actually review the chat logs and get these judges banned because I need some honest feedback not an 8 year old telling me to redress because the theme was coquette. I'd gladly sign up for this position. Alright. Final ick. Um, those duos whose spits aren't even matched or connected. If I got a Robux for every time a duo complained that they didn't place, I'd have 12,398 gajillion Robux. Now if I had a Robux for every time a duo complained and didn't match, I'd have 12,398 gajillion Robux. 
If you and your duo are complaining because no one voted you even when the server has decent voters, your outfits just suck and aren't coordinated. If your outfits were truly that good then you wouldn't have to complain. I am aware that because you are going in a duo you are losing votes, but I've literally never seen a good duo fall below 5th place, because if your outfit is good and coordinated with your pair, you will do slightly better. Like let's not kid ourselves, your outfit was just bad. Anyways, Thank you so much for watching up till here. I I'm going to include some funny submissions I got, but you it is the end of the opinions. Like and subscribe if I should do this again.